Hey everybody, my name is Weeblins and we are starting Judgment today. A number of you have asked me over the past few months if I'm interested in playing the Yakuza series and I've always been interested. It's just that it's really hard to find time because those games are so dang long. And while we're not playing Yakuza today, I feel like this is basically the next best thing. This is Judgment, the newest game by RGG Studio. It's basically set in the same setting as the Yakuza series, but it's a crime thriller drama thing, starring this man right here. If you're familiar with Japanese entertainment, then you might already know who he is. It's Kimura Takuya, or I guess it would be Takuya Kimura if we go by first name, last name. He's basically Japanese Brad Pitt. Extraordinarily well known, especially back in the 90s, not even just within Japan, but all over Asia. Anyway, I'm pretty sure we'll have more time to talk about this later on, but I bring this up because I want to say that I am familiar with him, and that's part of the reason why I'm going to be choosing the Japanese dub for today. I know in the Yakuza games, you could only pick Japanese voices, but in Judgment, we have Japanese and English. I had to listen to both of them, and I actually like both of them pretty much equally. But again, I do know this guy already, and the other factor that really pushed me over the edge was, um, I saw some gameplay trailer where the player was at the arcade. So the people in the game ended up speaking English, but then the arcade machines were speaking Japanese, which I thought was kind of weird, so... Figured we'll just go all out Japanese. Okay, let's just start. Oh, by the way, I have played the demo for this game before. There was one on the Japanese PSN last year, and uh, I think it's gonna be the very beginning part of the game here. Mm, yeah, this is from the demo. なるほど。ああ。それでございますか。もちろん私どもがお力になります。ああ、ご安心を。ディレクター、ルーゾーゲンダ。え、ああ、うちの親が見ようですか。いや、大変恐縮なんですが、彼は先々まで手いっぱい
伝えますどうした八神先生に弁護の依頼ですだろうよ依頼人は大久保新平ふんは大久保新平って八神が無罪にしたあの殺人で逮捕されたそうですいやだからその事件は俺が前のとは別なんですついさっき大久保が包丁で恋人を刺した後ガソリンで火をなわけねえだろ<笑>恋人を刺したって大久保君が恵美ちゃんをそんななんでだよ This guy committing a new crime pretty much implies that the first time we got him acquitted. It was a mistake, huh? の日弁護士としての俺はエミちゃんと共に殺された連続殺人鬼大久保新平の手によって Kamurocho shouldn't be unfamiliar to anybody who's played the Yakuza series, huh? Which I haven't, by the way. So this is all new to me. Kuchira Yagami. Kaito san, sotche do. Mou sugu da yo. Ima donki no chikaku da. Sotche ni mukatte ru. Investigator Masaharu Kaito. Ah, I see. I didn't notice. I just raised my hand. Oh, I was raising my own talent. That's too much. But it's interesting. The police are chasing the police. ドラマでもなかなか見ねえよなそんなのいいから慎重に See, this is the kind of thing that you would never do as a lawyer It's going back to his thug ways こっから俺も後ろにつくおっおっさん邪魔邪魔くせえなおい邪魔くすんだよおいはあなんだてめえこれえなになに死にたいのバカかこいつおい何やってんだタボいやーチンピラに因縁つけられてついついってお前が慎重にって言ってたくせにチンピラって誰のことだああカイトさん悪い後ですぐ追いつく適当すぎんだろう。Right. <笑>なんでそれ、マジなのこいつ。へ<笑>え、オッケー、やる気満々じゃ。八丁、八丁ってか。<笑>この野郎。上等じゃねえか。Here we go. Clearly, these last three years have really changed us, huh? We're not really 
We're kind of scruffy now. Blocking attacks, L1. Guarding is particularly important for surviving tough fights since the game will end when you run out of health. Oh wow, that's... <laughs> thanks for letting me know that. Furthermore, blocking leaves people open to attack. Oh, doesn't help if he gets me from behind though. <laughs> there we go. Lock onto an enemy with R1 and strafe around. Get him! Lock on and evade. You gonna get me? This guy's still alive no matter how much we hit him. Ooh. Grabbing enemies and picking up weapons. Okay. Oh! X actions or EX actions attack enemies to charge up the EX gauge at the top left corner of the screen. Having at least one segment of the EX gauge charge will allow you to use EX actions. And we'll press triangle whenever we want to do that. Press. Okay, do triangle after picking this up. Oh! Nice. I probably forgot all the commands already, right after you taught me, pretty much. <laughs> nope. It's a little bit fantastical, because then you get these, like, glowy colors coming out. Perfect. What the Kaido san? So Jay Look at how cool this guy is, with his ankle socks and runners. He went towards Pink Street, I should check the map, get my bearings. Okay, we are currently on Nakamichi Street, and we're trying to get to Pink Street. So we should make a... Oh, well, time to get over there. Okay, sprint. Can we turn a corner here? Right here. <laughs> that guy's text said something about buying a porno magazine. What did the detective look like again? Should probably take another look at the sketch. His hat's pretty unique. Interesting jacket, too. He has a distinctive mole on his face, 5 o'clock shadow, and almond-shaped eyes. It's the kind of face that someone not used to the city might feel intimidated by. Okay, time to see if anyone fits the bill. Tailing search mode. In this mode, you must locate your target based off their characteristics. We cannot exit first-person view. Find the person who matches. If anyone looks suspicious, R2. And then examine them. Hmm. Well, this guy looks like a good match. Nanda. No mole. 
Why does he look so dang similar? Oh yeah, we got him. Tail the target. When you make some kind of commotion that could attract the target's attention, the caution gauge at the top will fill. If it reaches the limit, you will fail. If you're about to be noticed, take cover behind a building or put more distance between yourself and the target. A countdown timer will start if you lose sight of your target, so don't do that. Just, how do I... <laughs> that guy's not moving at all. Do you want to move or something? Or are you just gonna... Oh. Your target may start to act more cautiously, as if they suddenly have an inkling that they're being watched. Well, you saw me that time, so yeah. If the target sees you when this happens, the caution gauge will start spiking. Failing to get out of sight in time will cost you the mission. But we can hide. You won't be able to move while hiding. So find the right time to emerge by pressing circle. So your target doesn't slip away. Alrighty. We gotta act all inconspicuous and all. We don't really know why we're doing this right now. Like, this guy has to do with something we're investigating. One of our cases, probably. But obviously, usually it wouldn't be the lawyer's job to be doing this kind of thing, huh? So we're getting down on the ground level here, so to say, and really putting in the work. ちょっと。ちょっとあんた。そろそろ溜まったやちん。払ってもらうわよ。もうちょっと待ってくださいよ。あと1週間だけ。本当ね。次はもうないわよ。はい。必ず。よろしく頼むわね。それじゃ。や
I think we were supposed to get behind him. Hold on. <laughs> so inconspicuous. カイトさん、探偵はチャンピオン街の方に向かってる。チャンピオン街か。あそこが入り組んでるぞ。うん、そろそろ目的地ってことかもな。よし。ハート飛ばそうか。空から持っかけよ。お。ドローン使うってか。
ギャンブル好きにはありがたいよな俺も今度やってみようかなあれもう行っちゃうのまだ探偵さんから金もらってなかったでしょなんだお前誰なんだうちの客のそのまた客があんたに金返してほしいってさ飲み屋から馬券買う前にね取り立てのチンピラかよく俺をつけれたなチンピラとはご挨拶だな俺はあんたと同業者探偵ってことかうん<笑>あんた逃げ足早いんだってでうちに依頼が来たってこと今持ち合わせがあんのも確認済みもう逃げらんないよさおとなしく払うも払いなふん確かに持ち合わせはあるでもな返すのは馬でもっと増やしてからだそれまで待っとけ That's what they all say. 本気で言ってんのかよくそんなずうずしいことまた今度だうなんでそんなもん海藤さんやつが逃げた見てたよ何やってんだお前くそ絶対逃がさねえ This is basically the tutorial section, so we get to do a little bit of everything. Chasing targets. When a target runs, so do you! Okay! Don't need to tell me twice. Oh, goodness. QTEs! Shoot. Come on, I've got to be more athletic than that old guy, right? Whoa! What did he just throw at me? Oh! We're fine, we're fine. Capturing targets. Now we're gonna get into a boss fight sort of thing, huh? Horse player detective. The way of the crane and tiger. Crane for large groups, tiger for a single target. So we should be using the red tiger right now. Alright. Okay. Finish the battle. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Do I have to be near a certain environmental thing to do the EX move? Maybe. I'll back up a little bit. You gonna get me? Oh my god. <laughs> I pretty much completely forgot all the moves already. I'm just throwing random things around now. Oh. Boom. Well, we can reference it on the side. <laughs> って言ってたな名前は<笑>今さら名刺交換でもないだろう
ヤガミだカムロ町のヤガミ探偵事務所 It's not working at the law firm anymore. ほら金渡してくれ手間賃込みで15万お互い紳士的に行こうふざけんなこんな取り立てあるか訴えてやるおい訴えるだてめえ偉そうに言えた口かちょっと怪盗さんな,なんだよ何が探偵だヤクザじゃねえかうるせえ借りた金返すのにグダグダ言いやがって、はあ、もう諦めなその人を怒らすとマジで怖いよ分かった分かった Stop the wrong guy とってくならマジで訴えるぞ見ろよ鼻の骨が折れてる鼻血が出てるだけだよだいたい先に手出したのそっちだろいやお前が先に殴った訴えたら間違いなく俺の方がなこれ弁護士バッジお前探偵なんじゃどうする本当に出るとこ出るでもやっぱ相手が悪いと思うよ Yeah, so this is where the demo stopped at. Definitely don't mess with this guy, both a detective and a lawyer. Seems like he's not currently practicing as a lawyer anymore, but he still has the badge and the license and the qualifications, I guess. We don't know exactly what happened in these past three years, but he's moved from the law office, the law firm, to his own detective agency. And I feel like you can see how that happened if you extrapolate a little bit. Like, he was able to do something pretty much considered impossible, right? He got somebody accused of murder acquitted. That's something that shows how good he is. But then it turns out, oh, shoot, the guy that you got acquitted actually is a murderer. So it's like, this isn't something that he can feel happy about at all. And if you caught it back in the cutscene in the very beginning, When he talked about the serial killer and his girlfriend, he called them o l Kubo Kun and Emi Chan. So, you weebs out there should know that this implies that they're not just a strictly lawyer client relationship. It sounds like Yagami knows these people personally, which would make it sting even more, huh? All of these factors compounding on each other, I feel like you can see why he would stop being a lawyer. But it seems like he's still interested in justice in general, though, because. Being a lawyer is like being the guy who. You talk a lot at the courts to make sure that your client is defended. But being the detective is like being out there in the field to collect evidence firsthand to determine the truth for yourself, what the case really is. Like, we all want to believe that lawyers defend the innocent and they're the paragons of justice, but that's not true at all, is it? Their job is to defend their clients, and I think Yagami learned this firsthand very painfully.